Holy crap, I was going outside to smoke. Right over there by the truck was a really good sized skunk. Which is not cool. I don't know where the heck he went to, but there was... I'm all paranoid. There's a skunk out there. And skunks don't like scare me or anything, but... I don't, you don't want to be sprayed by them, because... That's just really unfortunate. But I wish I, oh my gosh, I wish I had had the camera on me. It's always the good stuff that happens when I don't have the camera on me. Man. So, I am pretty sure I found the skunk. Oh, this is so nerve-wracking. I heard him moving right in those bushes right there. Maybe I can, like... Scare him out. See, I don't want to get sprayed, but I don't want him around here. This is sketchy. I really want to get him on film. I just don't want to get sprayed. If he sprays through that bush, I am so screwed. I found him. I scared him. Okay. I saw him walking from the front door. I'm just gonna see if I can. Yeah, he's over by the tree. He's over by the tree. I don't know if you guys can see him or not. I'm gonna try to get close. Oh, son of a gun. Try to get close, but not too close. Oh, okay. Yep, he saw me. Son of a gun, you little turd. I can get him out on the road. There he is. <laughs> I don't know if you see him crossing the road or not. But... Well, that was entertaining. Good morning. I am currently on my second cup of coffee, and once I finish that, I'm going to try to figure out something to do. Because I'm in that mood where... I really want to do something, but I have no idea what I would want to do. I have ideas of stuff that I want to do, and then I'm like, uh, I don't know if I really want to do that. So hopefully it's not. I still haven't gotten a call yet from, uh, oh, what was it? Chick-fil-A. Yeah, Chick-fil-A. I still haven't gotten a call yet, but I might get a call later. Right now it's around their lunchtime, so they're probably a little bit busy. Might call me when they're on their downtime. Alright, so I decided that um, I'm going to come out here back to this place. I don't know if you can see it, but that's where I was about five days ago, uh, the Ninja Frog video. Since it's rained a good amount since that time, I'm figuring this creek actually can have some water in it and not be bone dry like it was before. So I figured, why not come out here? Maybe I'll find something. Maybe I won't. Like I said before, either way, chilling out in nature. You just don't get any better than that. So I decided to screw that spot. I mean, yeah, it's water in it, but I decided I'd swing by and see if anybody was in my spot. Where I was here like a month ago. And nobody was here. So I was like, that's awesome. That is awesome. Man. So the water is up a lot more than what it was before. So I might not be able to go as far down as I did last time I was here, but I should be able to find some stuff, better stuff than over at the other creek. And I guess I'll just go as far as I possibly can go, and hopefully it'll be a good turnout. First little queen snake of the day. That's always a good sign. Like I said, I wasn't here, you know, more than two seconds, and already finding some good stuff. There we go. Hey girl, he's pooping all over me. Ugh, you are not making this enjoyable. Making it pretty stinky. Alright, I'll let you go. I found her under this rock, so I'm gonna let her go. Back where she was. Well, holy crap, there's a bunch of fish that just jumped. I got tagged. I found a snake. There's a northern water snake. Big dude, too. Under this rock, and before I get the camera out, he swung up tagged my hand and I dropped him and he took off but first uh, battle wound of the day I guess so 
finally found a nice little northern water snake here. Oh, he doesn't like the camera too much. But still, he is beautiful. He is gorgeous, that's for sure. Very cranky, nonetheless. But still, beautiful patterning on him. I mean, my gosh. My gosh, and look at this belly here. I mean, just look at him. He's just so cute. Not like, you know, with his temperament, but still. All right, buddy, here, 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 here. There you go. That is just what you love seeing, lifting up a rock and seeing a nice little queen snake there. Ah, beautiful. I'm just gonna let this rock back down, buddy. And let you do your thing. Holy crap, I knew there was a reason why I came out here, man. Holy, this is a soft-shelled turtle. First one I've ever caught in my entire life. And holy crap, is he cool looking. Holy crap. I am like on top of the world right now. Hey, hey, where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? He's got these crazy little legs, dude. And it's... Oh, he's... I didn't know they did that. <laughs> Look at that neck, though. Holy crap. Well, given the fact that these guys... Oh, oh my gosh, dude. This is awesome. I want to get him in the water as quick as I can because he uh, he doesn't need to be out of the water too long. But his shell is just like a rubbery, weird texture. I can't even explain it. This is so awesome. He is not happy and he could bite me. And he's got that neck, really long neck. I mean, good lord. That is awesome. I don't think he's going to let me get any pictures of him which sucks but still that is too freaking cool we'll let him go and see what he does holy crap he took oh my god i think it's good idea to just close the trip on that note that was awesome like i've never ever caught one of those in my entire life i came close to catching one when i was in paducah but he got away. It was a lot bigger than that one, but whoo! It's a lifer for me, and that just that's awesome. That is awesome. Well, it is after four, and I have yet to hear from them. By them, I mean Chick fil A. So I'm gonna just call them up and be like, hey, hire me. Well, I just got off the phone with them. And uh, she unlocked the application, you know, she was looking over it while I was on the phone with her. And they were saying that they were kind of dis discussing the possibility of opening up a position in the back. But they're still unsure about it. And so she had my application and to give her like a week or two. And if that way they'll have the application on file and if they decide to go that route, then uh, they'll, I guess, let me know. But... I really don't have like a week or two. I really don't. So, I don't know. I mean, maybe Brian and Steven can put in really good words for me and they can pull some strings or something. I don't know. But, it's good. At least they have it and that's going. So, that's good. Uh, it's a little late to try to call Rafferty's to check up on that as they're probably getting kind of busy for dinner. Uh, so, tomorrow, I'll give them a call at Rafferty's and try to see about that, see how that's going, and uh, we'll go from there. That's about all we can do. Oh my gosh, walking that freaking creek gave me an appetite like no other. I am starving. So hungry. <sighs> Ooh, chicken sausage gumbo. Ooh, chicken dumplings. Oh, I have to have the chicken dumplings. It's like a step back into my childhood, man. Chicken dumplings were just, I always eat these, ate these when I grew up. I was younger, I haven't had them in years. My grandma would always make them, and holy crap, you talk about a life-changing meal, but I'm really quickly discovering how difficult it is to try to open this and hold the camera at the same time. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat. You guys are so lazy. 
And you're laying on my towel. What the heck is that about? Huh? Did you instigate this? You have a guilty look on your face. I'm gonna blame you. Okay? Why is your mouth open, weirdo? My lashes. So... I'm just chilling here watching OK and Exempt Jess on you now. They uh, saw a tweet where she said she was going live on you now, and I was hoping to get lined up in the broadcast, but I hit it up too late, so I couldn't really do that. But it's a good way to kind of close out the night. I don't think I've, this is the first one of her live broadcasts I've actually seen. So it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. But I'm actually going to get back to watching this and chilling and I guess hanging out with them along with a thousand, three hundred and fifty other people and then just probably hit the sack because I got to get up early tomorrow and get back to that job hunting thing so all that fun stuff but I will see you guys tomorrow and yeah.